It's February 26 and Vancouver has received 15 centimeters of snow overnight and I am heading for the next adventure, another cold plunge. Very nice blue skies with just a few clouds. These are the items I take with me for every cold plunge. Swimsuit, water shoes, gloves, the best are neoprene 3 millimeters, thermometer, delicious and nutritious protein bars, towel with wrap inside hot water bottle to keep the towel warm and also to have warm water to pour over your limbs after the cold exposure. Spare sheet of plastic to spread on the ground to protect your clothes from dirt and getting wet. Plastic bag to put your jacket in case it's raining or snowing. Thermos bottles with nice warm tea inside. My favorite one is ginger with honey and lemon. I never get sick after the cold plunge and I believe a big part of it is because of this fiery ginger shot and that's a real light saver. It's very strong, but it really works. And on my way, I like to do the Wim Hof breathing session. So I carry with me a wireless set, in this case by Parasom, and always handy Kleenex. And I have arrived. Behind me, the entrance to the Lynn Canyon Park. I was here exactly a year ago for the Valentine's Day and I was here with lovely Jessica. Hello Jessica! Today I'm all by myself and as you can see there is lots and lots of snow. As I will go for a hike I will do the Wim Hof breathing now. Fully in and let it go. 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 So I'm on the bridge. The waterfall is just behind me. And that is the water that I will go for the dip. Isn't that spectacular? I just discovered that the surface of the bridge is covered with ice. It's ridiculously slippery here. And as I'm standing on this bridge, I'm so happy I didn't follow and listen to the no sayers today because this is actually my very big lesson of today. Never allow the naysayers stop you from achieving what you want because there will be always the naysayers around you and when you listen to them, you will never accomplish something. And this is the miracle today. My first jump ever! Woo! And this is how very well prepared I am. Remember at home I was showing you that I'm packing all those things. Look how very handy now the foil comes, spare bag in case the rain comes to keep the jacket dry. my hot tea, hot bottle in the towel because it warms up the towel and it keeps the bottle warm inside. I'm at the shore just moments before I go for the dip. See you in the water! And not to kid you, there is literally ice floating on the surface. Look at that. 
first time with my water shoes what a difference i mean this is a game changer oh. and you know what i've already done my cold shower today so this is the second time i'm getting in this very cold water and yeah it's quite cold and as you can see this beautiful scenery behind me <sighs> what a change to have the water shoes otherwise on those slippery rocks it will be really really challenging you know what this water is freezing i will have to be quite brief because i'm still going in a second for <sighs> for a swim i will leave the camera at the shore and i will go for the swim wow i'm so glad i made it it was my big big dream to come to lynn valley in the winter when i can have the snow around okay i'm going for a swim How is it? It was great, but the moment, of course, for everybody, the hands cannot be very long time in the water. The rest of the body is a little bit better, but the hands are always, always tricky. So here is me after the swim, and you may think I'm crazy. Instead of uh, drying my body and putting the clothes back, I am actually still standing with the swimming suit and talking to you but it never happened before and that's why I want to make a point you can see that I'm shivering a little bit and yes I guess it's normal but the point I want to make is that despite of shivering it's incredible it's almost like two forces at the moment there is this coldness and shivering but on my whole body there is actually like a heat as if I have flames of heat running all over my body warming it up I have never experienced this before but the water was just amazing and now of course the feeling is so incredible other than being cold but this incredible freshness aliveness like a rejuvenation it's just like you're on top of the world. It's basically that kind of a feeling. Oh, you see? What a game changer. Look at this. I can't tell you how very important it is to take a warm water with you. Now you have back the feeling in your fingers so you can put your shoes back. These are beautiful red legs. People are so fascinated with every bit of snow that we get in Vancouver that everybody is just expressing their joy. Yay! This one has a hat. 
So I'm at Blends now with my favorite drink, matcha latte, as always, my reward after the cold swim or cold shower. No different today. Can you tell that this heater behind me is heaven right now? Just a moment ago I had my fingers absolutely frozen because I dropped my gloves to the stream. And look at this a heater waiting for me at Blends. Ah, heaven! I guess that would be it for this video and I will see you soon in a couple of days when I will finish editing. See you again!